But there was a downturn in the uh, early 70s, I guess. All of a sudden, Republic Bank called all my notes. Vendors that we bought from, because I had always paid them off very well. And one of the things I found at that time, if, I, if you were honest with your vendors and tell them what you were going to do and then did it, uh, they would keep selling us. I built back up from there. I liked the idea of finding new products that we could sell both in the stores and wholesale around the country. We worked hard and eventually I saw someone showing a flicker book. So I came up with the idea of putting on a 7-Up camp. We ended up selling over a million 7-Up cans with flicker bulbs. I saw some place where people were selling ceiling fans. So I called Hunter Fans and I said, do you have fans? He says, we stopped making them, they're not selling very well. I says, well, how many do you have? I, they said they had 800. I says, I'll buy them all. So I started advertising ceiling fans to save money on your air conditioning. And we sold the 800 fans within a couple of weeks. Well, I think I was born with the idea that you shouldn't overpay for anything. So I think one of the things that I've learned is when I purchase, I need to know the owner of the company, tell them what I'm going to do and do what I say. Well, when John graduated from college, he wanted to come work for the company. I said, you ought to go work for someone else for a few years. And he went to work for Light O'Lear and they promoted him fast and ended up wanting, running one of their divisions. And then one day he called me, he said, I'm ready to come back. I said, great. And he then had a lot of experience in working for a large lighting company. So sold him most of the company so that he felt it was his. And he's now taken over. Everything is changing in lighting. I mean, now you can control your lighting with an iPhone. The lighting is a lot more complicated. So you have to have good salespeople and good installers in order to understand everything you can do. So there's an opportunity with more things to sell, and, but there's also, you gotta be more knowledgeable. The, well, the biggest change is in the last three years has gone from fluorescence to LED. And that's a big change. Being able to go into LED fast, being able to deliver fast. I guess I, I'm most proud of professionally that I've been able to run a business for over 50 years. I've been able to keep probably over 20 people who worked for me over 20 years. We've had a good reputation. I think people love working here and have contributed a lot to the company. My legacy to be that he ran a good business, he was good to his employees, and he was ethical with all his customers.